Previously, we went over what metadata was and what meta tags did. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the body and body tags, different body tags, and we're going to add content to our web page. So in the first video, we did add a little bit of content to the body, which was a paragraph that said, hello world, welcome to my website. Now let's add a title or a subtitle before the paragraph. So let's go down, tap over, type in H1, and go ahead and close that off. And in between these two tags, we're going to type in HTML website. All right, we're going to hit Control Save, hit Refresh, and there we go. We have a title that's right above our paragraph there. Let's just say that's too big uh, for you. This HTML website, it's just, this title is way too big for you. Well, if you scroll down, I'm just going to copy and paste this. Copy, paste, and we change this one to two. Hit Control Save. Hit Refresh. It's going to add another title, but it's going to be a lot smaller. Now let's see what happens when you go to three. Move the two, add the three, control save, hit refresh. It adds another title that's even smaller. So I believe this goes up to heading six, I believe. Um, and it decreases in size as you go down. So you can choose any um, any size that you want for your title on your web page. I'm going to stick with two. I think I like two the best. So just get rid of that and hit control S. And we have all our content on the right hand side of the web page, but let's just say we want to center it. So what we would do is go behind the head tag here and just type in center and close it off here. Hit control save, refresh the page, and it puts our title in the center. Now, what if we wanted our paragraph to do the same thing? Well, all we do is take this tag here, cut it, and we would place it right here. And then hit control save, refresh, and now it puts all of our content within those center tags in the center of the web page. Now, what if we want our text to be italicized or bold? Well, we can do that too. And I'm going to use bold on the hello world and then the italics on uh, welcome to my website. So all we do is add a B tag, which is bold. And we're just going to close it off before the welcome or after the hello world and before the welcome to my website. All right. And then let's go ahead and add the italics as well. Close it off. Now let's hit control S. Hit refresh. And look at that. The hello world was bolded because that's what we wanted. That's what we that's where we uh that's what we had in between our bold tags. And we had the welcome to my website italicized. Now if you want, you can add both italics and bold to the same uh words. All I do is since this is the ending of it, I'll just close it off here. And add the italics in the beginning. Hit control, control save, refresh. Now this hello world is both bold and italicized because we added both the bold and the italics. Italics, bold, bold, italics, both of them are closed off, hello world in the middle. All right, so that's it for this video. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If not, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.